Hi, and welcome to Two Tired Teachers. Really tired. <laughs> We've talked to you before about stuff happens and going with the flow, and that's today. And so we just want to kind of give you a live update. Um, it started this morning wonderfully. We did yes. get to see Baby Bison when we were leaving so Cap Rock cute. Canyon State Park. Um, but then we got over to, I, I realized that our refrigerator wasn't working quite right when I was trying to put it over on auto, etc. But when we got over to fill up with gas, we found out we didn't have any electricity in the RV from the battery. So, got out, was trying to figure out, I looked, all the cables looked great, and then realized... But, the, wait... The fuse, the fuse, the fuse definitely needed to be replaced, and I cleaned the little fuse holder and everything, but then we realized we hadn't turned the battery <laughs> on. <laughs> but we wasted a good 15 minutes there. This is our longest drive day uh, on a month-long trip. It's our first long day. We just, last night was a bonus of staying at Caprock. So that was our first uh, encounter. Then we found out we Our were, water pump yes. is just not quite working correctly. Mm -hmm. And so our goal is to make it to Cuba, New Mexico mm -hmm. uh, this evening. Well, also, we went to. Uh, well, also, I have had a recurring yes. infection. It's a viral infection. And if it gets really bad, it also gets a bacterial infection. So I had my doctor. It popped up right as yes. on Friday before we left on Sunday, but my doctor wasn't in. So today, this morning, I had them call in a prescription on the east side of Albuquerque so we can stop there, a nice big yes. parking lot, yes. and pick it up. So we were heading across Highway 60, which was the straight route. Uh, to get to Albuquerque. In the metropolis of Melrose, New Mexico. Just past that. Yes. They were going down to one lane. Uh, they had the construction. Yeah. And so we'd pulled over and then we realized the traffic coming our direction had gotten through. Our traffic started and then it got stopped. And it was stopped so good that I ran back and got our lunch out of the refrigerator. But that was after three emergency vehicles had passed us. And then we'd given the, we were so close to where it was getting to be our yes. turn, we gave the guy that was standing there, you know, holding the slow sign, a bottle of water. Well, we could hear his walkie-talkie and the, whoever his boss was said, tell the people around you it's going to be a while. And so I finished my sandwich and on that two-lane highway with traffic all, <laughs> you know, we're in a line of traffic, but there's a motorcycle behind me. I knew he wouldn't be. There was an 18-wheeler in front of me. Nobody coming, so I was able to pull over, up, and then make a U-turn. Uh, and Not so... Not everybody does on two-lane roads <laughs> in an RV in a yeah, line the, of traffic. The little guy that was standing there said, yeah, with this trailer, you're stuck. I thought... He doesn't know her. <laughs> so anyway, we are now sitting in the uh, Flying J parking lot of Tucumcari. Tucumcari, which was a town we hadn't planned on hitting on this trip. But what we've decided to do is I probably can fix the water pump, but we're not 100% sure. There is a camping world in Albuquerque. Folks, it's going to be a week before we're in another real town, yeah. and that's going to be Moab. Utah, uh, it's going to be a month before we're back to Albuquerque or a yeah. town that's anywhere near that size. So, this is one of those things of it's better safe than sorry. Yes. Once we pick up my prescription on the east side of Albuquerque, we were hoping to actually bypass Albuquerque, take a little... We're going to have to drive all the way through to the west side, to the camping world. We're going to buy a water pump. Yes. Then whenever we get somewhere tonight and I can look at it, get into it, it may be nothing and the water pump works great. But if it goes out again, we're going to have a backup with us. And whenever it goes out, and honestly, from what I understand, the water pumps they put in are the basic water pumps. Yeah. And we may get one that's a lot quieter yes. and works more efficiently. And go on and replace it while I'm messing with yeah. it and then keep the spare. I don't know. We'll see. But the point being, uh, we're hoping to get through Albuquerque and finish up with everything there before rush hour and get north of town uh but even if we don't get to where we're going to go and go to the same stop yes. it's just instead of getting there earlier we're yeah. going to get there a little bit later but we want to let you know it's still a great trip we are just we've been counting our blessings counting our blessings that we had the problem with the battery because literally 
we could have been in that accident that was on Highway 60 um, because it was that close. We got there before the emergency vehicles. Yes. We might have been we might have been in that. So uh, we've been praying for the people that were involved and thanking God that we weren't there. Uh, thanking God that the water pump went out where we have a chance to yes. get one before we get out in the middle of nowhere for however long. Thankful that my doctor was willing to call prescriptions in to a strange <laughs> location. So, yeah, stuff happens, but which way are we going to look at it? Um, we're looking at it as it's all an adventure. Yes. So, I'm also glad this happened on the first day and not the last oh, day. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyway, um, stuff happens, and mm -hmm. if you're doing this, you're going to have stuff that does come up, and so... Uh, we're taking a break, letting the pets out of their crates since we're not sure how long it's going to yes. be. We're just taking 15, 20 minutes here, stretching our legs since we know we've got to, we're about, yes. hopefully, halfway through. Uh, just taking a little time and to catching our breath because yes. it's going to be a long yes. afternoon. But it is all a part of the adventure. Thanks for, for watching, watching Two Tired, Tired Teachers. Teachers.